Hey guys, here's Hooked on Hurley. I wanted to uh, give you guys a quick video of when I went to Maui last month. Uh, this was on August 24th. On my wife's birthday, we were uh, at the Kanapali Shores and we hired 808 Fishing to take us shore fishing. Uh, my wife did end up getting an eel. We both got a little thing he called the cousin of Sergeant Major. So it was all shot on my phone. I didn't have my camera with me. There's a little crude video in there from the, uh, uh, the, the guide's phone. It wasn't as good a quality, but I wanted to keep it because Stephanie had caught an eel. So check it out, see what you think, and uh, I'll see you guys in the next one. Hawaiian reef fish. Yeah, so this is not a shoving weather, it's offering. So, so we're not sure chumming. Guys, we're we're sure sending we're sending an smart. offering. Let me make some real quick guys. So the fish here guys are very, very smart. They're one of a kind. Okay, they're known as nibblers. Uh, if you try and set the hook like that, they're gonna spit it out or right. rip it out, okay? Um, there's a few techniques. That you gotta ca uh, do to catch the Hawaiian reef fish here. Okay. Like I said, the noise nibblers. Uh, I see people hold their uh, reels like this, straight. Yeah. And they're flying out. This will drift right here. Right. Okay. This will drift. So check this out now. When we fly it out, we don't just guess or hope that we know what we're catching. It's a lifestyle over here in uh, Hawaii. When you guys come to the beach, tell yourself this is someone's ice box. Right. Yes. I got my line shot. Okay. Now, we is going this way. See if I'm doing any funny things, okay. I don't get more. And when I bring it in, all I'll do is uh, keep my tip more like this. I bring it in real quick from the right. rock, yeah. Okay, I try it again. I'll try it in a different area. Nothing there. Got Stephanie out on the pole now. Let's take a look at this bobber out here. So basically you got to hold the pole up, straight up, you want to keep the slack out of the water, just the bobber in, and watch for the bobber and feel for the bite, because going through the waves and everything else is very difficult if you keep your pole down. So you need to line up so that there's no slack, and then feel for the bite and watch the bobber to see when it goes against the current or underneath. So we're reef fishing near the reef here in Maui. We've got several different techniques. We're starting with this. He also has some live bait in the bucket. So right now we're just starting with this. We're on the smaller fish, and then we're going to start progressively moving our way up to uh, some larger fish. Stop them over there. Yeah. And where's the gap? So 
but we're dunking. Yeah, we're dunking right now, bottom fishing. Yeah, uh, shoreline, reef fishing. Yeah, we had to pull in because there was a turtle going by. Yeah. Wow, make sure we take care like that. What type of uh, bait is this? Uh, shrimp. Shrimp. Yeah, we're gonna chase the calamari in a bit. Okay, we're switching up to live bait, and you said this fish was called a what? Hole hole. Hole hole? Yeah. yeah and what is spiny. very spiky and spiny? Tasty. And what is pretty much anything eat this? Chivalis. Chivalis? Yeah. Fish eat each other like that. That is one big ugly stick. I don't think I've seen an ugly stick that big before, but he's going way out there in the deep. We're going to put this in a rod holder over here with a bell. It's like big cat fishing out in the ocean, basically. And we have the moon right over here, right above us. Hard to see. But we're going to set this up in a rod holder. What is that, about 10, 12 foot pole? Yeah, 12. 12 foot. So we got a big cowbell on there basically and I have never seen an ugly stick that big before so that's the reason why we have the pole holder too so it's keep it still straight up and still still yeah because uh they spot sensitive we'll let this like for like 20 minutes okay 20 minutes and then we'll go lucky catch and we'll probably go down the spot or something okay Keep an eye if you see any more live bait, like maybe close by. Okay. Like, catch them. In the meantime, we'll have stuff uh, You both can use uh, these bobbers. Like, go out that way. Yeah. Okay. Let's uh, find a spot like that. So, this, like I said, is probably one of the biggest Shakespeare ugly sticks I've ever seen. It's a 12 foot pole. But we're fishing with live bait out there. Now we're going to go out with some shrimp here on the bobber off the edge here, see if we can hook into something. We've already seen one turtle swimming by over here and a bunch of crabs on the rocks and we can see some of the smaller fish going through the reef and the rocks down here. So, All right, we're going to get set up and back on. Are you having fun on your birthday? At least we got, at least we got some shade. Oh. Was it getting a little snagged? Or maybe something biting it? Maybe we can get something over here? I gotta feel nothing. Yeah. Oh. That's your guy right there. I knew it. I get noticed that Oh, I know. Thank you for that, because I don't want to be the only one that does that. Oh, yeah. <laughs> I see you the time I go, oh, no. Yeah. It's realistic. We all do that. Yeah, I could tell. Trying to save the bobber. It's right there. All right, gang, get once again, we're here live here at Helix Fishing Hills. Here we got some Persego, all in the Hanau, with the Nepperdeals. Here we got some Persego, all in the Hanau, with the Nepperdeals. Big over here so we can bring it back to the water. It kind of, um, kind of, uh, they bite me a bit. I'm more scared of the eel than a shark. That's right, we're here at Helix Fishing Hills. Well, now Stephanie got one. Yeah. I saw your bobber take off out there. I saw it too. Another one. Okay. Nice. Let's see if we can get him off the hook. Yeah. Yeah, I was sitting there watching your bobber and I was like, dang, it just took off like crazy. So that's another one of those. 
same ones like I got. So. Cool. Let's get him back out there. Everybody, my name is V, the V Man of Maui. Um, I'm with the 808 Fish Eating Tail. Uh, much mahalos to uh, Hook with Hurley for coming out with us. Today is a special day. It's uh, Stephanie's uh, birthday. Hawale lahanao. Today they got a uh, QPP, two of them, uh, cousins to the sergeant major. Uh, they are good size like that. We're protecting them, so we let them go. Uh, and once again, much mahalo from 808 Fishing Tail. Aloha.